All right, guys. What is going on? Welcome to day nine of one year of games. I have to keep on remembering what the fuck I called this series. <laughs> uh, I've got my pretty gay glasses on today. I don't have my big ones. Um, don't don't judge me too much for that. But before I go into work, guys, um, I just wanted to run through my plan for the day and also what I've brought to work with me. So first things first, I ate a shitload of food last night. I'm not going to lie. I haven't... <laughs> I haven't been sticking to, you know, my macros and my calories. I'm putting myself in a very dangerous position. Um, I may find myself in three or four weeks soft as fuck and think, where the hell did that come from? But honestly, it's because I ate too much. But anyway, with that being said, I'm going to start the morning intermittent fasting. I've got a coffee here. I'm going to finish that before I go in. I have some BCAs, which I've put in a shaker. I'll fill up that in about an hour and drink that, so I think that's 10 grams of protein. And as well as that, at lunchtime, I've got a shake, which has 100 grams of oats, one banana, a cup of skim milk, and two scoops of protein powder. So that will be my first meal. But as I said, I will be fasting for the first part of the day, which I have no problem with. I've done that plenty of times before. So yeah, feeling really good. Um, Today after work, or possibly after work, or maybe at work, um, I'll be taking a client of mine to football training, and there's a basketball court down there, so I'm going to take a basketball and do some off-season cardio for the first time. So that should be fun, because I love, I love sport, I love rugby, I love basketball, I love every sport. I'm loving watching the Olympic Games at the moment, that's for sure, but I need to do some sort of physical activity that's not my NEAT, which is non-exercise activity thermogenesis or something like that. Anyways, I probably do about 10,000 steps a day regardless. What I want to do is amp that up on a, on a couple of days a week and get some off-season cardio in. So today is going to be basketball. Um, I'll check in with you guys at lunchtime and let you know how we're going. Peace. Alright guys, home on lunch as I said, uh, luckily my shift is in town today, it's not out where I normally work so I can actually come home for lunch, it's not long, it's an hour, it takes me like 10 minutes to get home, 10 minutes back so I've got 40 minutes while I'm here and what I've just done and what I do most times is I check YouTube and if I'm going to release a video I will, I'll edit it, I'll put the thumbnail etc and that's exactly what I've just done. So what I've actually done is released the last video the total last one of like this fucking collection of videos that I did that I shot probably over around about a two week period and they've just been re being released one after the other probably every two or three days actually sometimes every one day um, to keep the content going and to keep the subscribers coming in I knew that I needed some content, some quality content to release different sorts of stuff not just bodybuilding sort of stuff so I hope you've enjoyed it as I said, I've just released the last one, which was the fastest road in the Southern Hemisphere, which was when I took my car out to the Stewart Highway, which is about 30 k's, well, Stewart Highway runs through Alice Springs from Adelaide to Darwin, from around about 30 k's north of Alice Springs up um, three or 400 kilometers worth of road, there is a unrestricted speed limit. So you can basically, what they've told the Territorians and the people that drive on the road is to drive to the conditions and that's all you got to worry about because at the end of the day there's an extremely low uh, rate of, of death on the Stewart Highway um, and it is a fucking, it's a long road man, it's a 3,000 kilometre highway so you know to, to have to sit at a speed limit um, that's unreasonable for you know hours and hours and on, on end is, is not going to be good. With that being said, I don't think too many people would go over the old speed limit, which is 130 k's an hour. I mean, 130 is pretty fast in most cars. Um, but I did take mine out there, and if you haven't seen that video, I got it up to 235 kilometers an hour, which was absolutely fucking ridiculous. I, I was shitting myself, to be honest. But um, I did make a video of it, and I put it up on YouTube, so I hope you guys enjoy it, and I hope I get you know, car enthusiasts coming to my channel now. I've got all sorts of shit on there, so I'm feeling really, really positive about this YouTube channel. 
So like I said, all of those videos have been released. Now it's on to the task at hand, which is creating this series that I'm recording now for all you guys, one year of games. I'm so excited. I've downloaded a new video editing software. I think it's called, what's it called? Um, Power Director. So obviously I'm not using an Apple. Um, I had to sell my computer. So I'm using a PC and I'm going to be using Power Director as my video editing software. So I've probably talked too long and now I, now I need to get back to work. So I've got another drink of BCAAs. I had that shake at work. I also had two scones that they made because they do morning teas there all the time. Um, which I've counted as you know 300 calories or something like that. And I had two boiled eggs because they were part of my client's breakfast and he didn't want them. So I had those. So I am feeling pretty good right now. I'm going to go back to work, probably have another coffee, get me through the rest of the day. Um, I'm going to take some food back with me. I'm going to take some rice and I'm going to take some tins of tuna. It's extremely easy just to throw them together, make a good meal. You know, clean carbs, clean protein, low fat. Um, you can't go wrong. And then after work, I will be smashing the gym once again. Um, it's going to be arms. Haven't hit arms for a while. I've sort of been, you know, throwing them in at the end of my chest workout, the end of my back workout, things like that. And it's not optimal. I need a day where I smash the fuck out of arms and then probably hit them again once more each, biceps and triceps, on another day during the week so I can hit them twice a week because that that is the most optimal for growth and um, that's all I'm caring about right now. I want some fucking big pipes. I don't want 16 inch arms anymore man, I want 17s. So that's the goal. But anyways, with that being said, I'm going to go back to work now. Hope you guys are having a great day and I'll see you guys when I'm done. Peace. What a stunner, but it's not surprising because it's like this every single night here. So I've just taken my client down to the Oval for his AFL footy training. And in the background you can see the basketball court. So every now and then I'll get on the shift where we take him to training. And it turns out I got the lucky straw today. But actually, it's not the lucky straw because he's been fucking misbehaving like every single time. But Today, I was clearly the whisperer, and he has been behaving, and he's out there playing now. So I have a basketball, and I'm going to go and shoot around in the evening sun here in Alice Springs. It's officially the first piece of off-season cardio for me uh, this year of games. So I'm going to get into it. I love basketball. The last time I actually played for a team was in uh, senior boys at Kashmir High School back in Christchurch. And I wasn't the best player by any means, but I did fucking love it. And there is nothing like, there is no cardio workout, no cardiovascular workout like fucking playing basketball full tit for like a half. I mean, even a quarter, even a few minutes. I remember I used to get the most driest throat. It was ridiculous. Like, there was no workout like it. Not, not a rugby game, nothing. I've always loved shooting around and, you know, playing around with the ball. So I brought one down and we're going to have a few shots, see if I can dunk it. I'm not sure I can, I really don't think I can. These are, these are full size 10 foot hoops by the way, so if I do dunk it, um, kudos to me, but I, I doubt it. Let's see.
love this shit. I could do this all day. I don't know why I didn't use this for cardio when I was cutting. Anyway, so I'm gonna get this dunk. This is the last thing I do. Let's go. Damn fucking right I did. Stoked with that. Nothing can stop me, I'm all the way up. Hey.